the same one but now again it's a shift of the demand curve so it represents the appreciation of the dollar and the depreciation of the rand what market is depicted that is the foreign exchange market uh, what effect does the shift oh sorry if you okay it's fine if you say foreign exchange but the word foreign exchange on its own is different from foreign exchange market because foreign exchange is the act of exchanging one currency for another and foreign exchange market is a place where one currency is traded for another so foreign exchange is like a noun and foreign oh no 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 foreign exchange is like a verb and foreign exchange market is a noun so this one is a place and the other one is something you can act upon right what does what effect does the shift of the demand curve have on the price of the dollar take note they're asking the dollar so the dollar will appreciate the price of the dollar will increase or appreciate so take note what is being asked if the question changes to rand then the answer here you must say decrease briefly describe the term exchange rate how many times i think this is the fourth so make sure you don't go to the exam room without knowing how to define this term and also one other common thing we saw was the system the free floating exchange rate system you saw it's very very common All right so there is the definition what will the effect of the new price of dollar be on export trade between south africa and the u.s dollar uh, this would mean that American goods will be expensive. So exports from South Africa will increase. Why? Because <clears throat> Americans would find our goods cheaper. So they can buy, they can get the rent at a cheaper price, meaning they can also buy more in South Africa. So that will be a good thing. It will create oversupply of the dollar and that will cause the rent to appreciate again and so that is why you know this market is very volatile uh because the minute the rent is cheap they start buying our goods and when they're buying our goods they're oversupplying their currency they're demanding the rent each time and that will cause the rent to appreciate so you know it will always be up and down explain how an increase in the number of u.s tourists to south africa will influence the value of the rand it will appreciate as simple as that uh, more u.s tourists in south africa mean a higher demand for za uh, the supply of dollar will increase and that means eventually the rand will appreciate that will increase in an that will result in an increase in the value of the rand that's what i've been saying don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel also hit the notification bell for you to get notified every time we post new content to our channel. We are also giving away the Distinction Bound student t-shirts to people who buy more than 10 books. At the moment we have the following textbooks, Economics Grade 10, 11 and 12 plus Business Studies Grades 11 and 12. We are looking forward to adding more books to our catalog. Remember our books come in two versions, Complete and No Answers versions. Complete versions have answers and No Answers versions do not. Thank you so much for your support. See you in the next video. God bless.